Hey everyone, Corinne Henneberry here with the Red Carpet Report. Today we are at the NBC Comedy Press Junket. We are going to speak to the cast of Telenovela and Superstore. What an appropriate place for Red Carpet to I know. wind up. I am On the yeah. red carpet. Dun, 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 dun. Pretty perfect. Uh, How are you? Congratulations on Superstore. Thank you. Tell us a little bit about um, the foundation of this project and how you were intertwined and involved. Uh, it was a... Well, I, wait, where do you want me to start again? Sorry, that was just a really good question. There's many but parts <laughs> and many layers. I want to make sure I get all of them. Um, just the beginning process of this project. What, where, how were you swooped in? Like, where was that link? Oh, uh, my agent spotted this or heard about this project and heard about the character and, and sort of went and tracked it. I, I don't know how they do that, but they knew it was coming. And then, and then I, I, I read for it on tape and, and I felt a instant affinity for the for the character of Glenn Sturgis who's kind of like this you know wide-eyed Christian happy really super nice guy who's who tries yeah oh man so how close is your character to the real you oh in the naivete area very un uncomfortably close really yeah yeah in terms of you know what really like that's 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 my catchphrase <laughs> so as far as um, your cast members pretty much a, a young a young crew you have going on um, did you have to Stir their gravy. Yes, stir their gravy. Uh, no, I was no. gonna say wipe the whip, oh, but that no. doesn't make any sense. Some of these people are professional actors. You know, I'm from Kids in the Hall and Saturday Night Live. We we learn as we go. Yeah, yeah. These people have been to school for this stuff. Uh, but the amazing thing is, they're all. It's crack the whip. It just hit me. Crack the whip. Yeah, <laughs> I needed not crack the whip over everybody. They were they were there from the jump. They're very funny. Very funny. And as far as the whole concept of the show, with it being Superstore, um, I personally find to be extremely funny because there's so many elements that can go on within a store that have comedic qualities. What did you find to be the most, uh, like the obvious and easy way to, easy play out? Uh, well, it's a family. It's a workplace family. And everybody's had one. And, and I bet even you can think, like, if you go back in your head and kind of go, oh, that job. That's right. You could see the chemistry working. It's the same thing is happening here. And it's happening in a superstore, which I think if you're going to talk about America, that's almost where you want to go. Yeah. Perfect. Well, thank you so much. We're so excited. Take care. Thanks. Hey everyone, thanks for watching. Please be sure to give us a big thumbs up, subscribe to more videos, and be sure to tell us what show you're looking most forward to, telenovela or Superstore. Uh, kids in the Hall news, anything like that? Are you guys going to yes. tour or anything uh, like that? Well, we toured in the spring. Kids in the Hall toured in the uh, spring. Uh, it may turn out that it's the first half and we go out and do that again. And there's also burblings about us maybe shooting some some of uh, some new sketches for something. And we're also on NBC CISO, which is launching, I think, in January. It's where you'll be able to go and see SNL and Kids in the Hall and a bunch of really great comedy shows. And It is. One-stop one stop click on on Friday night.